Sarah. Hello? What the? Okay, Tang, my, myself, Jack, and Tarek, um, we've been tasked to put together a night's watch uh, for the villagers. Our job would be to supplement the guards and help with minor disputes, things like that. Um, we were looking to figure out some new members, and we um, think you might make a good addition. It's just keeping the peace. That's... So... Are you interested? Help keep people safe. Deal with the situations the guards either can't or won't deal with themselves. And if we ever catch wind of anything that should be brought to the guards, we essentially act as an extension of them and make sure that they are given the information they need. Times of dress. I will be able to assist in this way. Fantastic. Congratulations. Begin? Uh, well... I think we're still not quite official just yet. We just need to speak to Mirandel. We work under him. He's the Yalman. Um, it goes essentially Mirandel, Jack, who's the captain. No, not literally. It goes Mirandel, Jack, who's the captain, myself as the lieutenant, and then so far it's you, you and Tarek are the uh, the watch members, so to speak. We are the watchers. I see. So if you're on board, we'll uh, let Jack know. Um, it's mainly at night time that we, you know, but just for the most part, keep your eyes open and uh, try and keep the peace. And we kind of work together. You know, our job is to supplement the guards, etc., etc. Just seeing if you're interested. I usually do that in the first place. Exactly. That's why we thought you'd be a great fit. Understood. Very well. Thank nice. you, Tang. I find, plus I find the villagers are rather amiable toward you. I actually admittedly don't think I've ever heard anyone say anything bad about you, ever. They have been saying weird things lately. That's but just nothing rude. bad. I am unaware of asking me to sleep with someone is bad. I think that's a good thing. I think it's a very good thing. Mm. Anyway, we have meetings every now and then, but we'll, we'll we're still kind of feeling <coughs> things out. But now that you're a member, we'll we'll keep you clued in on stuff. Understood. Appreciate it, Tang. Thank you. Welcome to the team. I'm going to not move my hand. All right. The last time that I had done that, I had crushed the deer's head. I would rather not crush anybody else's anything. Right. Then uh, I'll just do this from now on, then. Mm. <laughs> Welcome to the team. Alright, I am going to let the captain, Jack, know, and uh, I'll be <coughs> seeing you around. Thank you, Tang. Ding, ding. Question, Kyla. Y yes? Does anyone actually know what Jack's last name is? No. Do you know what my last name is? No, but I hmm. feel like he kind of makes me think of a bird, like a sparrow. Captain mm, Jack Sparrow. No, he's more of a more of a pigeon, I think. Captain Jack Pigeon. <laughs> oh, hi. By the way. Yeah. I don't mess any of those oranges up. That's the only things that can keep me going. <clears throat> but I will be arming myself up oh, for Derek. whenever. Pardon. Tang's in. Nice. Yes, Tang was agreed. Just right. come to let you know. I'm still having some trouble getting in contact with the hunters because it's like, of course, you're never going to find one of them around. Very well. <laughs> Thank we you. believe in you, Captain Jack Pigeon. Right, what's your last name? What? Jack. Huh? Well, Orsus. Orsus? Yes. I thought it was Swallow. Sparrow. And Tang thought it was Swallow. 
You're a captain. Your name's Jack. So Captain Jack Swallow. Perfect. I need food. I'm hungry. Should we get food? <laughs> Tavern. Tavern. I'm going to go and kill myself. Thank you very much. That means I get to take over. No. What are you taking over now? <laughs> Nothing. Are you sure about that? Yes. Is there a problem here, sir? Very well. I want like I want some fruit or something. Um. Well, I'll be back in my place. I have oranges. Ooh, I can go for an orange. Citrus Just a moment. Okay. Okay, is this is just cold. Oh, hello there. Hello. I see uh, Drow and um. Human. I'm sure. Am I right? Yes. yes. All right. I mean, the Drow is kind of an obvious pig. No, there's no way. I like there's another Drow right there. Look at her. He's actually talking to me. But I want to see it then. Anyways, nice to meet you. But uh. Name, if I may ask. Uh, Tarek. Oh, nice to meet you, Tarek. I am Jack. I'm a hobbit here. Hunter. That's all, thank you. Thank a you. A hunter named Jack, you said? Yes. <laughs> well, nothing to meet you. Hello. Where's Kate? Oh, so I mean, oh, you kind of look quite young. I, I'm assuming you're um, oh, young adult or um, teenager? Kate! Can't tell. Oh, well, one does come of age at 15, and I have seen 19 winters, so... Hmm? There's that. Alright, I shall refer to you as Babyface. Alright, what is the term <laughs> sleeping with someone have a double meaning? Hold on a second, is that a bloody Oh, yes, it means to fornicate. Uh, uh, yes. And before you ask, I already met the... To, um... To sex. To fuck. To, oh, no. fuck off. to uh, to lay with. Hello there, um, big metal Hello. man. Uh, I see that you're a bloody wolf watch. I've never seen one before. It's just me or mm. he and I are very similar. Is this oh, sorry, just... I don't want to be so rude. Hobbits like My that. Name are they very Jack. jumpy? I'm a hobbit. Oh, I I would love an orange, please. I've been craving them all day. Okay. Alright. I sell them for 10 copper. And you, 13. Oh, you don't have to go for me. The first day I showed up to this town, you gave me one for free. That's the least I can do. You fed me. It was rotten, but it was food that I hadn't eaten in a few days. I didn't forget. Thank you. Ah, uh, those are the, indeed fresh. I just got back from the capital, and those oranges come from Gradia, so... Uh, I'm from Gradia, actually. It tastes like home. Oh, really? Mm. Thank you. Yeah, that's welcome. Would you not sleep with him? He was down here with me, Sergeant. You should accept more personal favors as a payment for your message. No, 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 it's just a coin. Do you see the purple man? What you got there? Hang on. What? Something's wrong here. Say that again. Oh, you, Drow, what you got? Just making sure. What the fuck? Fuck. That could have killed oh, someone. Where did I come from? <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's gonna dump, 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 dump. I think it's a sub. It's gonna. No, stop. No, stop. Standing under. Yeah, yeah, it might be safer. Oh, you drown. Anywho. Something just fell from the fucking sky. 
pick it up. Yes, they threw a shovel. Oh, I didn't understand. What you got there? It's 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 an an I'm, do I'm doing. No, no, I want to talk to the drow. I called him first. You fuck. I get to talk to him first. That was okay, so did you get to talk to him? You're too done making out. No. Anyway. No Drow, we yeah. might need you tonight. Can really? we use your eyes? What are you doing? <laughs> Keep a watch on the town. Actually, I don't you say that. <laughs> <sighs> um, we're actually, we've actually put together a, uh, a night watch of uh, some of the civilians that your captain will be talking about later. But I'll be around, yes, yeah, so you can use my eyes. Well, we're to supplement you guys so you don't Good. have to we'll do so much... Them. Give me those eyes. <laughs> <laughs> we're, um, we're, we're to supplement you so you don't have to deal with so much of the uh, well stuff with the villages and things. You can focus more on the walls. We're to help you guys. That's what the uh, have you seen any, is supposed to be. Have you seen any of the people working on the wall? Nope. Not yet. For the palisade. Okay. <clears throat> what? By the way, was the fuck? Sergeant? Are you okay? Just ran off. Just oh. ran off. He's uh, telling people he to work on the palisade. Is it just... Is, the two yeah. of you that were asked oh, to come, there, come with the sergeant, come like, with me now. Where's the other one? Right. Where's the second one? I don't know. I, 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 I'm there. very couple. All right, there, there. Go ahead. Were you the second one he asked for? There you are. Come with me now. What the hell is going on? Oh no. I just take live. your post and don't worry about yeah, it. Yeah, just, just, just shoot can, I get, can I get, can I get, can I do me a favor and lend me a hand here? Can you help me pick up some stuff? Okay. Boy, uh, what? Did we do in the, the guard? Sorry about that. Can you pick up uh, a couple of these and just bring them towards the tavern? I also need to talk to you in a moment, but I need to get this done first. Just eating an orange, man. <laughs> just trying to eat. Yeah, at least put that on your hip. You don't want it to leave that around. Uh, keep, keep an eye on it. Okay. One in May of the guards. Yeah, quiet. Good friends here. What the fuck? What are you? What? Oh, oh. My head is extremely tough. Right? Don't, don't question me. Just because they brought that up, I feel like I'm just punching you in the face to prove it. But I'm not going to do that because I'm. I suppose. Summer. Okay, right. never mind. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I need a little bit more. This is actually one big grey. It's just I have to take it in pieces. <sighs> need a hand, Morgrim? What else are we taking? Uh, if you want to grab your stuff, um, I'll explain to you something in a moment. Right, I'd be a little more careful. People have been stealing shit all over today. Well, I didn't have a fucking option because Mirando needs me to fucking carry shit. Backs. Yeah, I'm keeping an eye out. <laughs> well, maybe I can fashion you a sheep someday. Yeah, it might be for the best. I've seen it before. <laughs> I'm sure you have. You're right, Drow. <laughs> Hey, see, what if I do ever come across him? He's asking okay, why I'm fucking asking. Have you seen her? Oh, no, yes, I've got people. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've she's insane! Well, not that way. Hey, I'm gonna put it Thank you. <sighs> What's all this? The great that um, Nicholas ordered. <clears throat> Alright. Ah, oh, I see. What's happening, Morgan? I'm just having to uh, build it, so give me a moment. Morgan, please! Not a problem. Oh my no, god. Okay. I got oh, you, kid. I get his attention. Oh. 
Ah, yes, I was going to uh, Sorry, Nicola. requisition a mug. Yes. Uh, a mug of water or ale? From Grady, apparently. Feel and all. That's what I'm going to have. We'll have some ale. What the fuck, sir? Yeah. Tastes like home. Orange. There you go. Yes. Orange, you glad I didn't eat the peel? Cool. Thank you. Well, you know, you I once knew a man who did that. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I hope you'd at least wash your hands first. He always had his he always had his food served to him, so he never knew how to prepare it himself. And the one day he decided that he wanted to eat an orange on his own. He picks the thing up and eats it straight through the rind, bites clean into the thing. What a chad! Are you alright, Sarah? This the strangest thing I'd seen up until that point in my life. Since then, there's been far worse. But. This is really yeah, good, Tara. Yeah, she just wandered out there. She does what she does whatever she pleases. No, it's true. Whatever. Yeah, the more I think about it, the more. She I mean, it is an orange. It's from Grodio. Curious, we're sniffing around. Right. Restless. Oh, just like you. And then after she like, takes like home. It's a little bit of energy because she becomes exhausted. For a bit. Mm. Pops right up. Right, like a puppy. I get another one. Home for me is. I've heard her dry bread and oats. I have and too, and it's very strange, mm. I will say. It's not, Dang. It's not a lot of chicken. I'd like your assistance with something. Uh, okay. Well, girl, I'm Can helping. I have a quick word with you. <sighs> okay, yeah. quick. As, a, as important, come with me. I heard something of import that you may want to know. Someone has evidence that you or Sarah may have killed the priest and the other faculty. Okay. I heard it in passing when I was moving a crate from the forge. Cool. Who said that? Telling you now, you tell her. Who said that? Uh, some. Sorry looking boy. Blackish cowl covered in dirt. Yeah. Uh, wouldn't worry about it. We know who killed him. Just telling you. Yeah, I appreciate it. <clears throat> it's more these claim that they have proof that you did it. Uh okay. You may wanna have a you may have a wanna have a work with Cerebus. Uh Okay. I can't catch her on my own, so... Right. Does that get warm? Tang. Nope. Uh, it's easy. If I stand and say near a fire. Is he? Who are you looking for, Nirendal? Dang. Oh, I don't fucking know. <laughs> Thanks. I think, I think, I think, um, check the mines? No. Uh, <laughs> Oh, it's orangey. <sighs> Unties. Sarah! Fuck.
Oop. Well, uh, good luck with that. Um, did you see that other hobbit in town? Aha. Uh -huh. uh, what was he about? Uh, who was that? Oh, his name is Jack, by the way. Oh wow, like your ear kinda has some music. Ugh. Hmm. He said, he, like, he addressed me like this. Oh, hmm. Well, that's I quite said, nice. Yeah. There you go. It's like, <laughs> like a lady might, you know, he said, Ugh, and I said, Ugh. and then he said, oh. It's kinda cute. Inviting me to something, he said, oh. And I said, oh, you know, like, oh, like, I have, like, stuff I need to do today. And he said, oh, you know. <laughs> ah. Yes, you hobbits have a very interesting, um, way of greeting each other. Yes. Huh. Hmm. Huh. <clears throat> yeah, man. As do you elves, you know? Uh, excuse me, won't You're you? You're explaining to, like, what you like, right? Ooh. Okay, that's... <clears throat> That's not right. Sorry, that's kind of offensive. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're fine. Uh, you're fine. Um, Continue with your training. You're doing well. Oh, it's just a yes or no question, really. Uh, right then. All right. Uh, are we like is the night watch official yet? Technically, like, have you got the word back from Gavis? Uh, well, I just spoke to him just now, and um, um I don't know. Our numbers you have grown. I've, I left him the, uh, the the report that I reminded him about. He's probably waiting for saying a that, to um, give him the okay. He absolutely is waiting for forward to vet the people that I have uh, well, uh, a recommended list, like a fool. A list has grown. Very well. We can at least get that out of, out of the way so when it's inducted we can have our members prepared. Very well. Um, as it stands, Jack is the captain. I am the lieutenant. We have Tarek. We have Tang. We are trying to get Lucian. And we are thinking of bringing on, at least as an informant, uh, one or two of the hunters. So eyes on the outside of the which, city on the woods. Which hunters? Not the trapper. The hunters. Right. Very good. And, um... Yes, that, that sounds good to me, uh, as far as we've chosen. I have no problem with any of those. Captain? Hello there. I was just asking Mirandel if we're technically official. <laughs> we are technically not official yet. I just spoke with the Lord. He is going to wait on his advisor's word to decide who is going to be captain, but... Based on my recommendations, of which you're the only one that showed any real interest, aside from Kyla, but we both know his position is best suited as uh, your second. Hmm. Well, either way, I wanted to come by and say that uh, all those who are in agreement are, are, well, agreements. We have Tang to help support the night, and during the day, he's pretty fit because... If he does get into a fight, no one's going to want it to fight Tan. He seems mm. pretty calm and methodical about everything that he mm. encounters. Good peacekeeper. Uh, we brought Tarek along as, a, as another day, another person during the day. He's good with a blade. I've seen him fight and he seems to know how to calm people down when it comes to the worst of it. So right. I trust he can probably do it as well. And we also chose Lucian. I've seen him fight as well, and he seems to do very, very good at with knocking down those who want to try to fight. Hmm. Yes, uh, those names match up with what Kyla told me. I don't have any problem with any of those. I believe that's a good choice. I've also asked some of the hunters if they could act as proxies while they're out in the woods. Just eyes and ears if anything tends to come that way. I've told them to report right. it to us. Excellent. I'm feeling better. Good. Glad to see you got it all sorted out. Hmm. 
And you think I wasn't responsible enough for this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy that you're proving me wrong. Right, Jack, I'll go leave you to it. Way. I've got uh, the matters I need to attend to. Hi, Kyler. Hello. Kyler. What the fuck? God damn oh, wow, magic. I was just standing there. Time today. Listen, everyone keeps walking up to me. Where is this? It's a town. People walk around. It's just yes, how it is. But how many times do people appear behind you without you having a single inkling of it? Mm, not often, actually. I'm pretty good at hearing people. Yeah, exactly. I've had it six times today. Open six your ears. Times. Let me hang on. Let me see. I, I listen. I'm not an elf. Not hey, no, not an elf. Wait. No, clean your ears. I asked Selenor with the spear, but then I realized that was probably a bad idea. Clean your ears. Go down to the river and clean your ears. You'll see. You'll hear a lot more. I can't. That requires me to get out of the town, and I don't trust that. Hey. Bye. Fuck. You did some like. Training too. I'm just seeing what you're up to. Every once in a while. I do more at night time myself, but uh I'm just curious. Oh uh, <laughs> a trainer told me that well, you know like why do you? there's certain articulations for the armor and they go, Oh, you know like Like you mean like I'm covered in metal and it's like oh like I don't know your secret <laughs> uh huh. Certain but points also, in the armor uh, are weaker than others. Yes. Uh, and also, like you can pretend, hey, like, hey, Mister, you, know, like, you seem kind of handsome, don't you? Uh, 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 uh. And he comes by, it's like, kick, kick, you know, yes. right in the back of the knee, and he's like, ah, ah, yeah, uh, ah, yeah uh. mm -hmm. and then you go, ha, ha, ha. You right planning on, throat, on you know, killing <laughs> someone? Uh, uh, Oh. <laughs> oh. I don't want to kill anyone. Though, you know, like. So. If somebody got me into a. Oh, you know, mod. Uh huh. <laughs> like, let's say. You know, normally, like, I'm like this. Oh. Yep. And if somebody was like. Err, like this. Oh, and I was like. Ah, you know. Oh. Right. And then they were like, like in the back of their knee, they're like, ah, you know, like this. I grab the back of their head, ha. Huh? Can I, can I see that? <laughs> yes, of course. Wow. You do some serious damage with that. I'm glad you're learning how to use it. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, so I was saying, like, uh, in the back of the knee, and they're like, ah, you know, like, uh, like please don't kill me, uh. And it's probably not, like, great for me to, uh, you know. Do you uh, think uh, you, could, like, you could do that to someone like that, if you uh, had to? Oop, that's the wrong button. Ignore that. Whoa. Do you think you could do that to someone if you had to? Only, only if I, like, absolutely have to. Like, otherwise, I just, ah. Uh, like in the back of their knee, ah, you know, like I can't move. Like you could probably go. It's like, oh, thank you. Like I'll go. <laughs> that might be your best bet. Maybe when you uh, stab them in the back of their knee, you could run. Yes. Uh huh. And I'm. Sh you pointed up to under the. What about me? What do you mean? Mm -hmm. Well, like, like let's say you had somebody and they're like, ah, and like please don't kill me, would you? <laughs> I have done. Oh. oh. You killed the surrendered man. No, he wasn't surrendered. He was dying. He wasn't surrendered. There's a difference. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of like a mercy kill, right? The gods are chasing. What did you do this time? What did you do, Sarah? I simply. Sarah. I'll leave it to your training, I'm fine, don't worry about it. You no, you're sneaking up on me this time. Well, I mean, that's, uh, drought. 
Oh, capacity for mercy, you, right? Uh, like, like, he was, like, in such agony, so you, like, ended his life. Um, well, it was... That a virtue? Sometimes it's either you or them. And he was the kind of person that, after stabbing him in the knee, he would get back up and try again. Sometimes... Sometimes you have to do that. I see. I hope you don't have to. I have thought you honestly. <laughs> but, by the way, uh, I saw you. Oh. You know when, like, those tree things, they're like, uh, and they're like coming yeah. to attack us? Mm hmm. And they're like, uh, like, I come from, like, with the rune soil, like, uh, like, uh, cool. and I was like, ah, uh, like, I was, like, hiding inside. Mm hmm. Well. Uh, I did not have thought <laughs> you uh <laughs> sorry, like my voice is kinda like shot today, I don't know why. But I did not have thought you were among the people who are defending us. Hmm? Uh, I really appreciate it, thank you. Yeah, just thank you very much. Looking after everyone as best as I can. You don't need to bow. I'm not I'm not worth a bow, please. No, honestly no, like I know that the drow you know, kinda get a really hard time right here, like in Castle Edward, but she had like, you would fight to defend us. Well, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, well, like, normally I don't like this, but... <laughs> Maybe drink some water. This is kind of like, oh, uh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Try that. Wait a minute. Wait. Oh. Oh, yeah, we tried this, didn't we? Well, I mean, look at it. showed me. Oh. 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 <laughs> what? What? Surprisingly light. Oh, like something that's like completely huh? metal. <laughs> and that's not even a well balanced one either. Yeah, I can tell every time I move it to the left. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> right. Oh. That's because I made it when I was drunk. <laughs> no, no, I think it's because I'm super weak. <laughs> Uh, it you probably... know, Baylor went out of his way to say, like, he, he went out of his way, he said, hey, like, no offense, honestly, but you're, like, the weakest person in town. I said, ah! <laughs> but I said, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. But anyways, like, yes. Go for it. Yeah, let me try, like, you know. Ah! You know, I was the weakest person out of my group of friends. Huh? Hmm? Aren't you? No. And you must have like lots of really strong friends. I'm a weak person. Like super strong friends. It's not my skill yeah, set. Yeah, right. Well, I don't carry do logs. Do right now, I'm a scribe assistant. A bit of this, bit of that. The past it was different, but. Yeah. Do you like scribe like your weight? <laughs> I was. Today I did that much, you know. Uh, uh, <laughs> get over my head. It's nothing. Yeah, let me just let me get this a try. Yeah. Oh. Come on, you stack of. Hey, there you go. Nice. Well struck. <laughs> Careful. I'm sorry. Are you, like, you alright there, Maya? No, yeah, I'm fine. To be honest. I see in a little jar frame there, it's happening. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> can't yeah, think of a good nickname for him. Like, what should I call him? Wheels of the blade of such size. Oh, you know? Kyla. Oh, mm. oh. Has Tang spoken to you already? No. No. I need, I need to think you said you need my help, then I got distracted. Maya's Maya. That's fine. Um, it, it's not immediately urgent. Um, but nah, be something has already been brought to our attention that I wanted to pass along to you. Okay. Very pass along. Um. I don't know if you're busy with this right now. Or... No, I was just keeping an eye on her, making sure she's practicing safely. Remember, Maya. <laughs> Practice safe stabbing. Use cross guards. Alright, shall we? If not, I can probably teach you a thing or two with those. Oh, look. Maybe 
I did drink Iron Frosting too, but I'm not. I am not in the mood for your wheezing. I hear you one more time. I hear you wind one more time. I think I should go to. I'm gonna pretend I, uh. Hello? Not a pirate, but the shoemaker. I had a look at that one. Do you recall your venture down into the ca uh, into the old um, ruins in the cave? Unfortunately. Tang said he heard a noise coming out of it this morning. It sounded like something smashing itself against the metal. Mm. He said something about an iron gate down there. Yes. That's how we stopped them from coming to the surface. Said. Close the gate on them. Well, from the sounds of it, whatever's down there is trying to remove the gate. But from which side? Do you think something's trying to get in, perhaps? I don't know. Hmm. Still, if, if it's as dangerous down there as you've told me, then mm. I figure this is something to keep into consideration. Right. All right, we'll keep your ears open, Tarek, and uh, we might have to collapse the mine. Oh, he runs fast. <laughs> might have to collapse the mine as a last ditch. From, from the sounds of it, Tang is against the idea of collapsing it. I'm sure Tang is also against the idea of mushroom people invading the village again. At the very least, we could use it to buy some time. But that's when, that's, you know, if the worst thing happens, but... Mm. Um, I could let Rowlet yes. know, just so the guards are a bit more on edge. That might be a good idea. Mm. I believe Tang was going to let Mirandol know. Brilliant, that was going to uh, be the worst thing. I'll go with... I'll go, to, I'll go with you to find uh, the captain, then. Sure. All right, let's have a look around. Have you seen your captain around? Is that it? Well, you can't see from here. No, I think he's up with we don't know where he is. He's somewhere with Mirandel. Right. Appreciate it. Fuck is up if there. I were a Mirandel, where I think that's, would I uh, that's up there. One of them definitely has a sword. One on the right is Rowlet, the one on the left is Mirandel. Hello. Hello. No, Hello. I don't want to make out with you. Fuck.
Captain? I'm waiting for Mirindel to come back. He's here sketching. I, I know. See. He disappeared, eh? I suppose I should wait too. So, is there need? Yeah, just letting you know some information, but Mirindel needs to know it too, so. Just wait. Apparently, the other drow broke into the church again. According to my men. Yeah. It's gonna have to deal with that afterwards, is that true? I don't know. I heard she was running from the guard. She told me she didn't do anything, but fuck news at this point, Captain. Apologies, headache. Getting a mm. lot of those lately. Um, so. Tang has brought to mine and Tarek's attention that this morning he heard something coming from the mines. The deeper parts of the mines. Like what? Oh god. Hi! Did you mean from the crypts? As we were transporting the drow from the, the, the tavern to the dungeon, she hit me in the face and ran to the guild. She assaulted a guard and now the guild is holding a fugitive of Bledford. So we're asking permission if we can go in They took and the arrest courier her. as well. Jesus. They took the courier as well. You know, I've let that girl off a lot. She's lucky. I say. He's abused your kindness. Yeah, we can't be. We, we, we can't. We can't be used as fucking jokes around here anymore. We're being hit. She's fucking maybe breaking into places. Lads, 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 lads. Come on, now. You're not Ledford's men. You can't handle a girl hitting you in the face. Calm yourselves. All right. I'll deal with it, but no need to cry about. It. All right. I'll get some of the men, and we'll go sort it out here in a second. Mirindel, right. I need that finished. By the end of I'm the day, huh? Done. How basic do you want it? Just enough for the advisor to understand what he's looking at. He's fucking, I also, know, I'd like you to write a little bit of a description at the bottom. <laughs> I'm sorry. Of the importance of what I pointed out here and what I pointed out to you specifically. Of course. Thank um, you. Note the. Uh, other things as well. The noise you heard down in the mine. Mm. What does it sound like? Something hitting metal. Uh, Apparently, according from Tang. We see it before. Like, I will go look myself. Be careful. After I've dealt with this. Mm. What a busy day. Right? Been dragged everywhere. I should probably watch this and make sure Sarah doesn't do anything too stupid. Be safe. I brought it to both of their attention, yes. Right. Everything okay, Tang? Oh, oh, fuck, I'm gonna be so desperate. Actually, we yes. should probably stand there. Mm -hmm. yeah, I brought it to their attention. We're lame to shot in our guard. Thanks for letting us know. Shooting that all fucking day, so. Like. Fuck, you relax. I'm surprised you have any arrows left, you fucking twat. <laughs> All up in here. Upstairs. Right over there. Don't you fucking open your mouth. Keep it shut. You can't say a fucking thing. You have a so. Captain, watch yourself. You live in Ledford, yeah, you're under Lord Gavis' rule. No we actually don't. Uh, act this technically acts as an emissary. As soon as you leave Adwick, this house, you're, you're under way, Lord Gavis. Gavis. your mercy. But while you're in here, you're in fucking Adwick. Act like it. 
coconut. Hostilities Thank aside, you. this was from what I really? understand, all a, a dumb debacle that blew up more than it ever needed yes. to be because uh, she's very, uh, very active on her legs. And the guards didn't take lightly to that when they wanted to ask her something. She ran in the other Unfortunately, go... I've heard that you've broken into the church again. I didn't even go near the church. I've only been in the in its courtyard once today, and it was to bring uh, him to the fucking church. Guards reported her running that. away from the church, and they found breaks on the locks again. I didn't. I can confirm she would not church. have had the time to do that. But of course I've you would do it. that, lad. You're her caretaker. You're her I don't friend. Even have any locks you also know that I'm a loyal and lawful citizen. <clears throat> You've also hit no. a guard. I will swear I'll go to the fucking dungeon. I will sit in front. And fucking say the exact same thing that I'm saying now. I didn't go into the fucking church. Did I run around and I'm teasing your guards all the time because they're fucking assholes? What? They are nipples. I am. But I didn't break into the fucking church in broad fucking day. Do I look like an idiot? <laughs> Honestly. Look, uh, you're testing my patience. Mm. If a guard tells you yeah, to stop, you are stop. Testing your patience, not me. Don't blame me for their issues. If a guard tells you to stop, that's, you stop. That's just how it is. Unless the guard is wrong. It doesn't matter if they're wrong. I'll find out eventually, and then I can set it right. I. Well, I'm not fucking dealing with it. You think I'm fucking dealing with that on top of everything else in this fucking town? <laughs> You're funny. I'm not dealing with this shit. If I get in trouble, I get in trouble. When I'm doing nothing wrong, purposely because if something bad happens, it happens to him, not me. I bear no ill will to your carrier. I don't know why you think that. Of course you do. <laughs> Fine. I'll go. Who the fuck knows? Lock me up for doing literally nothing. Just so he doesn't get hurt. Because I don't want to hear about him having a black eye tomorrow when I didn't. Slow down. Captain. I'll help see to you that nothing like that happens again. There's no need to drag her all the way to the dungeon over something as trivial as this. Don't hide in places where you think you can't be caught. Oh, but this is Castle Adwick. <laughs> yeah, what it bloody is. If there's information they can help, she was being chased around. Edge had a busy night, Sergeant. Regarding, um, I, 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 I had a busy night getting beaten by the guards. Yeah. Hey, shot with a crossbow bolt, getting robbed. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Welcome to Ledford. My evening. What about you? Uh, not too much. Pretty quiet, actually, surprisingly. Oh, some people got attacked last night. Some of the guards got attacked. Did you hear about that? Oh, yeah, we were just talking about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some uh, hooded robed figure running around. Killed about 10 or 11 of them. Anything official? Oh, yeah, they are uh, bad news. They're what? See, news that came out of the north here. Yeah. Was it yesterday, I think? There was some sort yesterday. of caravan that was... Uh, right, yesterday. Caravan that was leaving Lionel going to Ambershire to help deal with their uh, food problem. Mm. Apparently had a detachment of their houses troops, mostly civilians, helping run the wagons and such. They were slaughtered, it seemed like well over a hundred people dead. Mm. No one knows who did it, no one knows how. There were a couple people who managed to escape, claimed that they were hooded, robed figures with masks. That's about it. Supplies were burned and room was killed. So this I mean, I understand why the guards are on edge. Well, when I saw them on the edge of the forest later that night, the last I saw of them, they ran away on all fours. Oh, fuck that. Man. Yeah, it was fuck fuck that shit. I, that's exactly what I saw. No. No man runs on all fours. Makes no sense. I'm just saying what I saw. Robed, masked. I saw the enemy on all fours. Mm -hmm. Like single time, and they have curved swords. 
<laughs> you have a curved sword. It's not quite a curve, I mean, it's a mess. It's more heavy than anything. That's why the blades are thick. There's no point to this other than adding weight to the end of the blade. <laughs> Stop showing me that fucking thing. <laughs> Well, I know you boys like to... My mother told me to only say things when they are nice. And otherwise, keep my mouth shut. Right, and uh, do you listen to your mother Don't still? make me disobey my mother. Hmm? Of course I do, why wouldn't I? I loved my mum. Why wouldn't I? I don't know. Just if you boys end up going on the road. Yeah, there we go. Waiting for it. Uh, just if you boys end up going on the road, just be careful. <laughs> you know, if those people are about. Because I know you like to travel so much, Sergeant. Can I bother you? I do love walking to and fucking from. Say again. What was that? Did you actually see those same things or people, whatever they were, running around last night? I only saw shadows. Vague bits. Never mind. He only saw shadows. Well, mm. it's hard. Dark. Better than, better than the description that we got, because the best we tried to get was from a man with his tongue cut off, which made it very hard <clears> to <throat> actually convey anything like useful. Cloaked, hooded mm. figures. One of them ran away on all fours. That's basically all I saw. And apparently, killed all ten guards out there. So that was. Not a good sign, really. Probably the same people that uh, right took one of Eldred's eyes. Oh yes, the bullet. Looked like mm -hmm. they tried to take both of them, but they apparently don't know that eyes are next to each other because one of the cuts was above it. Well, make sure to tell them that if they ever catch you. I will. I'll say, Sergeant Blaze from the Mercenary Guild, that building all the way over there, <laughs> told me to tell That's you. That's petty, mate. That's <laughs> fucking petty. <laughs> Told me to tell you to fuck off. Yeah. I mean that I too. That, was, uh, that too. You're not wounded. Just fucking him. A really ugly fucker no. that's always on the right side of the castle gate if you're walking towards it. Round, fat, pink face, dogs like he's all time. <laughs> yeah, tell me it was that mm -hmm. busted. Okay. <laughs> yep. I will keep that in mind. Totally did not come so, uh, from anybody <coughs> inside the guild hall. What exactly oh, are you? I'm a drow. Hey, you shut your no. fucking mouth. I don't <laughs> think he was asking you. I'm pretty sure everybody knows you're a drow. They're I know asking. what you are, purple one. I mean this one. Hmm. Green one? A dryad. Broccoli. No. Broccoli. I guess that I'm not... Why does I make that mistake? <laughs> what do you get out of it? I was talking about vegetables. Please. Yeah. <sighs> you know, you come to me and say you're gonna break my shins? You know, I'm an elf. I take offense to that. Well, I mean, no, if I, I was gonna well, actually, are always I fighting. mean. If I was going to break your shins, I wouldn't tell you I was going to do it. But see, I see, would just but see, do it. You know, elves are elves are all about talking. You know, if you you're going to say something yeah. that's like factually incorrect, they're, oh, yeah, they're going to take all that seriously. On. Factually incorrect, Mister. You talk in circles around everybody. 
Well, you know, I'm not every elf. Oh, that's the other. Let me read. Let me read the video code. That's what I was saying. Here we are. Mm. Go weird. Mm. Oh, hello. You, uh, hello. Jarman? I still can't think of a good name for you. You're getting there. Maybe, um, hmm. I already called uh, the other draw Miss Sneaky Purple, but uh, I'm not sure what to call you. Mr. Sneaky Purple, to you. Mr. Sneaky Purple, gotcha. Do you? I know draws are always sneaky, but they're not quite sneaky as hobbits. No, people just tend to ignore you. There's a difference. Wow, he actually got a drink. Look at that. Oh, whoa. Yeah, you're right about that. I have a lot better after drinking that. Yeah, what was that? Yeah, no, I have not that I bought for an Alexia. Yeah, no, you'll you find some crumbs. What are you talking about? There's a fucking crumb right there. No one yours, you dumbass. Did you just eat that? No, I sniffed it. Anyone? Yes. Throws it at you. He's. <laughs> <laughs> These oranges that the uh, merchant's selling, they're all the way from Gradio. <laughs> Tastes like home. Yes. Delicious. Well, I've had a few of them already. <clears throat> Busy day.
God, I miss when things were simple. That would be interesting if someone showed up. <laughs> I just kill him. Servers back up. <sighs> Captains are not crumping. I know for a fact they're not crumping. Boo. You scared me, cat. Did I scare you? I'm terrified. I knew it. Can't drown not seeing the sunlight. I heard that. It hurts. From a story once. So why are you in the day watch? I'm on both, technically. Oh. I'm just you eating. Can see very far. Yeah, I can see about as far as you oh. can. It just on the brighter days it hurts my eyes, like torch lights and stuff. Mm, I'm just, I I'm see just you. eating. That makes sense. I'm just here to eat, man. Oh, you're just. Oh, I thought you were um on the day watch. You're <sighs> very watchy, so I decided to come up and pester you while you were uh, working. No. If you're not working, then I won't bother you. That's too boring. Oh, well, now I kind of want to be working. <laughs> oh, I see. Wait, so you want me to bother you? Uh, oh, Kyla. Only if you have nothing else to do. <laughs> Don't, don't ever say that to me again. <laughs> button up your shirt, for fuck's sake. I, d I don't have a button, it fell off. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> it's a fashion statement. Having your tits out for everyone. I have a job to do. As a barmaid? I'm a barmaid. Mm -hmm. Well, as most people say, I um, am just simply a mere distraction, so might as well make use of it. Alright. Do you think it'd work for me? Should I yeah. undo my buckles? <laughs> I thought... Um... I, I, I don't know. Maybe? It depends. It might work on Cerevith. You should try it. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that would work at all. Really? Yeah. I don't understand Drow. Me neither. Does she not like... 
Wait, but you are a drow. Yep. Surface drow. A surface drow. Wait, there's a difference. Yeah, imagine living on a deserted island your entire life, then suddenly coming to Ledford. Mm. That's kind of what it's like. Understandable, yeah. Alright, that makes sense. Oh, god. Spooky. Ah, Where? that's better. Now I can see Have properly. Have fun eating your orange. Oh, god damn it. Have fun eating your orange. I'll um, let you know if I'll I find your button. Stop bothering you. <laughs> Thank you. So, I don't know if I'll actually sew it back on. Seems like a lot of effort. And I think I'm you lazy. like the attention too. Clearly, I am an attention whore. Or maybe, maybe I'm just a whore. I don't know. Regardless. Have okay. you talked about that with Tarek? Talk about what? Your line of work. My job? Yeah. Uh, I don't even know if he entirely knows what I do. Well, he seems really pretty upset anyone when we Did mentioned Baylor and stuff. Did he know? I think he's put oh. two and two together. Well, to be honest, that wasn't actually a job. That was kind of... That's probably worse. Yes. Well, it, I mean, it's like an X. You know, it's... I mean, well, not like, not really an X. It's just more of a fling. You know... It wasn't really like... Tarek's... I, you've probably picked up on this, but Tarek's well, not really versed in this kind of stuff, Kat. I'm gonna need you to kind of hold his hand right. through it. Oh, God. That's fair. Um... I don't know how to talk to him about it. I feel like... I tr I've tried giving him some, like, brotherly chats about it, but he always seems so lost. Like a... Like a little <laughs> a rabbit. Puppy. Yeah, or a puppy. Yes, oh, that's even better, yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I... Should probably figure that out. Maybe a conversation uh, to have. Uh, yes. Yes, it would. It should probably be... I mean, to be honest, he's been staying in by my bed most nights, so I haven't really been doing my um, side work as of late. Mm -hmm. But, um... I suppose I should talk to him before an opportunity arises. Well, at least lay down the ground rules. He's a delicate boy. Yes, he is. He's a delicate little flower. I tried teaching him how to swim today. Anyways. Oh, really? How did that go? Um... He did really well. He was a bit scared, but he did really well. I also have to ask, what what are you and him? Are you like a thing thing, or are you like fling flinging, or like, what's the deal? Well, it's definitely not the same as Baylor and I. That was a little bit more flinging and more just kind of messing around. This seems more... serious? We're taking it slow. Yeah, he really likes you. For obvious reasons, but also, yes, he does. I care about him as well. Good. Mm -hmm. <sighs> well, time to go follow the idiot as he goes somewhere he... Where the fuck is he going? Well, oh, hello. Uh, how long have you been there? Not long, I literally just came up here. I need to have a right, chat with Right, okay, Kayla. good. Have fun, he's all yours. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Evening, Morgan. Hello. I am no doubt about to annoy you with the information you already have, but I feel I need to tell you regardless. Go ahead. The Christian told me what it was that they found. They found a dossier on the acolyte. It uh, disappeared. Mm hmm. And uh, where did they? And that was the item that was shown to both the priest and was apparently found by said person. I believe that may have been what was taken the other night. Uh. Uh, to the right, I think. All right, thank you. Um. Okay. Who showed it to who? The dirty lad apparently showed it to the priest, and then the priest showed it to Lucian. And Lucian told me, so that we could warn you. 
The priest is dead, though. The priest apparently did it to himself. It's the other one that's went missing. The other acolyte? However, this boy believes that you're responsible. Right, what does the boy um, look like? The two of you are, as I described before, dirty, looks like he's young, and what I can only describe as a blackish, brownish, a blackish, bluish cloak. Currently keeping tabs on Seraphith and Cade in the tavern. Okay. You might have to point him out to me. Otherwise I would have went to Seraphith herself, but, uh, I feel that you need to know as well. Alright. I don't know if you know or if she was responsible, but given the other day when she came covered in blood, I can only assume she was, so... Yes, yeah, she was bragging about it. Um, point him out to me. Let's, uh... Just so I know who it is. Like, don't be obvious, obviously, you know. <sighs> Hello, a little bit. It's all good. To be, to be honest, I shouldn't need to tell you. You'll probably figure it out yourself. Mm hmm. Are you all right there, lass? Yeah, I'm just hanging out, having a drink. Something of the sort. I find myself unable to do so. Alright, so I'm gonna ask you to find myself somewhere. I'm gonna find myself somewhere. I'm gonna find myself how much would it be to get uh, a scabbard for this, so that I don't uh, cut myself? To get the scabbard, oh, just... you would need to get the measurements taken, which isn't too difficult. Ah. Much. I would talk with Lucian about the cost of the leather, but yes. after that, it's just a simple thing. Yeah. Yeah. So we would I'm need... Do you want it to attach to your belt, or do you want a belt to go with it? You sure you don't want any more this one? It's actually really good to be Lucian about the leather cost, I'm like... One of those bottles of herbs. Uh, Nicholas, do you think to have that meal ready? I have heard a bit. Oh, would you like see that you have a bit of 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 a bit Give, give me an actual number. Can I get one more mug? I'll pay for it. Mm. Uh, what do you feel like, lads? Venison or rabbits? I'll just have a drink. I'm not really hungry right now. I have a uh, idea from the shack. Here you go. Here you are, lad. Uh, it's just another note that I'm wanting. Well, I still got enough for you, lad. Which Meal I'm giving you. Uh, just give us some of the rabbit love. Save the venison for later. Hmm. He chooses the rabbit. Let's see it by tomorrow then. It was a nat 20 plus 2. Advocate says anyone who eats this collapses in happiness. Well, if he, did it, if he didn't strike during the day... I'll be back in a few moments. There's actually something I'm reminded about. We'll have to leave in the morning. Can I get three on right. the day? Yeah. Need any assistance? Let me know. Alright, we've got rabbit and venison. Are they here? If you'd like rabbit, I'm going to go there. Right. Right. You anticipate something might happen that way? I do. I do want to talk about getting my my combat armor arrangements. Let's get your um. Why don't you ask your friend to join us? Um, I think I will keep it to myself for a bit and work uh, from the shadows for now. 
little more experience or something, I don't know. What color shirt are they wearing? I am a bit too much of this team. This is gonna be fun. Oh. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, yes, uh, we can talk into the, in the forge if you want. Yeah, I gotcha, I gotcha. Alright. Right. I do need to drop by there again anyway, so... Good walk and talk. Okay. Again, I'm glad that Ian Dill was able to help patch you up. He said he was wearing a, a blue shirt? You and her Dark, dirty, air unkempt. Black hair, okay. Hair unkempt, not black hair. Got it. I'd venture to argue that half the town would disagree with that. Hello. Okay, now that I'm not handling the needle, I'm fucking. How are you doing today? Best from what you had. Good. Finished dinner. Mm. Tasty. You know, more grim. Oh dear. <laughs> I actually need to do something really quick, and he'll be right back. Okay. Hi. Guess I'll die. You're dead. Please don't. Hmm. It's not good for you. That would be a shame. Be honest, Hey, fuck. Everything all right, Soma? How's the Night's Watch going, Mr. Sergeant? It's, uh, a Lieutenant, Lieutenant. sorry. Yes. Yeah. Uh, it's going good. No, I wasn't doing that. I was just eating. I haven't started, technically. I don't know. Mm. Time, but I what else have you been up to today? A little bit, from the guild hall bit of this, bit of that. Possible job that might be coming up okay, uh, next. I'm, not sure be I'm working on something. No, I will not see people on... Uh, what is it? Probably a gore or so, but someone's been following me. Disappear and attack. Mm. Mm. Sounds like something that they would have needed. Mm. I'm figuring it out. Very tragic. If you're not disabled, there might be a pact of going on my own. Can we go for a walk? Is that fucker over there staring at us? No. Okay. That's the case, I might need a little bit of like on, on you, like Should we go for a walk? Mm -hmm. okay. You following me? You picking Can nose? You not? I was scratching my nose, thank you, and I'm eating my food for the evening. Good. Good. Hope you enjoy it. Of course. Of course Good I bitch. will, thank you. Purple bitch. Maybe not today, but oh. tomorrow. At least you called me purple, not blue. <laughs> Did you Hello. try some? I did, it was so good. <laughs> good. Thank you. Would you like me to run that, uh, well, I just came I told, I told the captain you better come back and buy here and try it out, because he's going to miss out on some really good food tonight. He doesn't. I mean, this is fucking delicious, so... Thank you. <sighs> this tiny little... Oh, dad, it come on. This is absolutely phenomenal life. Oh, it's just me. You can't get mad at me. It's, it's, it's okay. okay, it's nice, you know. Yeah. I'm looking behind <laughs> something. Like, <laughs> we're just, we're just about Anyways, um, well, you already gave me your answer, so I guess I can't. Upsy daisy. With one hand to pick uh, me up. Power the roads. Mm. I say one of the uh, these. Do you see your pull out a dagger and slice in the corner? Oh, Kyla. Hello. Where are you off to? Right. Walking around. Need something? Yeah, Alright, oh no. Uh, potentially. I would like to know more about your cease, uh, race. A race? Why? Too bad, there's nothing to know. We woke up with amnesia and we know nothing. Helping with the palace. You! Go sitting on your master's lap again. Untie your shirt. Oi! Don't fucking. I'm already injured! Why must you do that? Hold up. Take it back. Hey, 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 hey. See, now he's leaving. Bye. It's your bastard. You remember it. Kyla, why are you acting like this? We're having a good day. Nothing has gone wrong. You could be laughing and joking and goofing, but you're mad. I'm mad. It's distracted.
Um, apparently. I keep looking down at me. Hmm. I'm used to it. Apparently. Oh. You're gonna get fucking through it. Right, sure. <laughs> Better about yourself very now. disrespectful today. Mm. Yeah, I do. That's right. the attitude. So the person following you apparently was the person that took that thing from you, the dossier about the female priest. He then took it to the now current priest, and he has been keeping tabs on you since. Am I supposed to be scared? No. Of the fucking church? No. The same church I just fucking murdered. With a fogger's help. Oh, I would have killed her anyway. Don't you fucking say it was all Fulgrith. No, I said he helped you. And watch your fucking attitude and remember who you're talking to. Who am I talking to, Sarah? You're talking to Sarah your friend who you're treating like a fucking dog. Really? That's a so different change. Unless you don't change. want me as a company? I would love you as company, Sarah. But I don't like you clicking your fingers at me, telling me to sit like a dog yourself. We're friends, are When we have not? I ever done that? Yesterday. When did I do that today? Not day, yesterday. Yesterday? Mm-hmm. When did I click my fingers at you and call you a dog? When I entered the tavern, you were sitting there with... A, I think it was, or someone. You know, you might want to start looking into the other... parts of you. Because if you don't want to act like a fucking male drow, then don't. I'm not. You're gonna fucking hate the Underdark. You're all fucking dogs down there, do you understand? What you're wearing right now? Yeah, and we're right not now? down there, Sarah, are we? What you're fucking wearing right now? Having the audacity to speak to me that way is funny. Laughable. Yeah, Very we're not in the Underdark, are we, Sarah? We're up here. It doesn't fucking matter, this place might as well be the Underdark. I don't need your fucking help. I don't need you treating me like a child. If someone's following me, I'll take care of it when I find out. Stop acting like a dick. You done? Are you? I'm done. Because if it's just going to be, oh, I'm so annoyed with Sarah, blah, 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 all day, you can fuck I haven't off. been annoyed with you, Sarah. I can read you like a book. And you're reading it upside down. You can't fucking read, remember? I'm stressed. I'm agitated. I've got this things on my fucking to do mind. With it. Well, don't take it out on me. I'm not you don't taking see me it taking out my on fucking you. stress out on you. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. I'm generally stressed and annoyed. I'm not taking it out on you. If I was taking it out on you, I would be yelling at you, screaming at you, doing anything like that. I can feel like it. That. That's well, just your me attitude right now. and your tone and presentation is not. I'm not for it. I'm sorry, it doesn't appeal to you. You need to learn how to mask yourself. Hmm. What are we doing about Arn? What do you want to do? We go in there, we die. We don't go in there, we die. If we go in there, he dies. If we don't go in there, he dies. What do you want to do? You want to fucking waltz up in there in the middle of the night and break through. All of the locks. Get past all of the guards. Royal guard. I was asking Mind you as a friend, Sarah. Now who's getting annoyed? I don't know what to do, that's why I'm asking you. I'm getting you. annoyed with you because of your fucking attitude change. What am I supposed to do, Sarah? Act normally like I treat you. Even when I'm at the brink of fucking having a breakdown, I don't treat you like shit. Don't you? You expect me to serve you. No, I don't. Serve me. I was trying to talk to you You're last lucky. night. I have been fucking forcing you to be a drow. I could have been doing a lot worse. Let's see you fucking try. I could have been fucking with every little. <sighs> do you know? I was trying to fucking talk Grabs to you. Grabs by the fucking ear. Drags you down <clears> to the ground. <throat> <laughs> you! We're not in the fucking Underdark, Sarah! And I'm not a fucking full drow. You know that. Enough of this. I'm not gonna butt heads with you over this bullshit. I'm sorry if I'm not being what you want me to be. You'd have a better life, it would. Maybe. But that's not me. Then fucking obey! I know what's fucking best for you. Not on, not the fucking scribe, not anyone else in here. Me! Then where have you been? I. Fine, I'll just up and fucking die! What? Whoa. Where the fuck I'm is that coming mother. from? I'm not. Don't. I have to deal with my own shit! 
I get You're that. Not my main priority. If you want to drag me in the way of the drow, then do it. But fucking be there. I, Cause right now I'm feeling all these things. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do with I them. I don't have time for you. Then don't right be now. upset when I'm not going the way you want me to go, Sarah. I don't have guidance on this. You are the only fucking person. The fuck I want to get upset at. And if you're acting like an asshole for no fucking reason, because you don't communicate to me when you feel these ways- I was up there last night trying to tell you and you told me to suck it up. I'm trying to talk to you. I'm trying to treat you as a friend. I want you as my fucking friend. You dismissed me. Like you do when I was trancing. Close to me. You dismissed me. I'm trying, Sarah. I'm trying to be what you want me to be. I'm trying to be what anyone fucking wants me to be, but I don't know where I'm fucking going. If you want me to go down a certain way, then help me get there, please. Because right now, the water I'm trying to you swim in is everywhere. To. You don't want to! You will never want to! So just leave me to dry. You said it leaving. yourself. It's a right. whole big thing. I'm rewriting everything I know about this fucking world. It's scary. Okay? And I need that guidance. Sarah. Do you want to be a fucking slave? Not really. Do you want to kiss my feet and carry me around as I fucking walk? Not particularly. Do you want to listen to every little fucking thing I say even though it goes against your moral compass? Do you not want to have a moral compass anymore? Do you want to be a fucking concubine with no brain? You would obey everything I say and not speak. You would have no tongue to use. You would be an extension of my body. Maybe down there. And nothing more. No. It's not about the Underdark. It's about the Drow. And I am a full-blooded one and I am going to make this place my bitch. Whether you are by my side or not. Do you understand? Do you want me by your that side? Everything that has been going around here, everything that's been happening has been me. All of the break is. All of it. Yes, I know. The rest comes naturally. Do you want me and by you your side or do you want me under that your foot, fooling Sarah? around. They both go one and the same. I will be above you no matter what. Forever. There is no equality. You are below me. Is that what you wanted to fucking hear? It's easier with men like Cade. Sorry, I'm not fucking Cade. I don't want you to be Cade. What do you want me to? But I'm not do? choosing one of you. Did I ask? I... Did I ever ask you? You don't want to, to choose. Know. You're making it seem like it's either I have to treat you a certain way or I can't have you at all. I just want guidance. I don't know how to guide you. I'm a bad fucking person, apparently here. Everything I do is against the law. Everything that comes natural to me is against the fucking law. I'm not asking you to make me a good what person. What am I supposed to guide you to do? Into the fucking dungeons? I can't just teach you drow. You're going to hate them. You could teach me small I things, just... like how to fucking trance. That would be fantastic. I, I don't know how to teach you. You're supposed to just fucking do it. And I can't. And I'm sorry. But I can't. I'm not a teacher. I'm young. I'm still growing! I don't fucking know anything about drow! You're treating me like I'm some fucking deity! You're acting like you were! For fuck's sakes! <sighs> it's called confidence, Kyla, which you lack severely. How can I have like confidence deities. in this? I worship the right ones. First of all, you're in the wrong fucking place to be confident in what you are. We both are. But I was lucky to have lived there before even coming here. I already have that fucking confidence build up. I'm not a teacher. I cannot teach you anything. You have to learn on your own what you have been doing. But no, it's not good enough stupid. apparently for you. 
It is fine! Then why... What's this then? With my attitude? Because of your attitude! You are giving me lip for no fucking reason. I don't have time to be by your side 24-7. I'm not asking you to be by my side 24-7. other things. You just said, are you going to be by my side? I can't promise that. You you were the one that said, by my side, I'm going to be doing this, and it's up to you if you want to be by my side. That's why I was asking you. I'm not asking you to give me all the fucking answers. I just need someone. What I want is unfair to you. That is why I have not grabbed you by the fucking neck and made you my bitch. Do you understand? I don't want to. I do. But the risk of not succeeding is worse. Because the one thing that's worse than being alone is having a drow hate you. You do realize if you are to be by my side, you are to be my property. Cade is mine. He belongs to me. I own him. Does he know that? Do you want to be like him? Of course he fucking doesn't. And he won't, because he's going to be dead in a century. And I will still go on. And I will find more. Our lives are so long, you cannot sit and get sentimental of every fucking human you come across. Cat, Tarek, on, they're all going to fucking die. I'm aware of that now. Soon, too. Yes, I know. Then, like I said before, suck it up and take your fucking time. You have centuries if you play your fucking cards smart. Stop dilly-dallying with these useless people. This entire place is going to be fucking rubble in however long. We don't even know. And you're sitting here worrying about friends and relationships as if they're not going to be crushed anyway because of what you are. You don't know what I'm worrying about. You didn't ask. You didn't let me explain. This isn't a therapy session, Kyla. I have my own shit I'm I worrying about. We were friends. And you know what it is. Apologies. We are friends. Then friends talk to each other. Can't get mad at me for not talking to you when I'm busy. I get that. Trying to save my own fucking life. I know. Self preservation. Fulgrith has me like this! I Kyla. know! Then stop making it about you! You have other friends to complain to. You do realize if you tell me something, I have to tell him. It's so not- whatever it is you have to say, it better not be against the law. It's not. Just trying to confide in someone I felt close to. That was it. Then... Fucking say it. It's so important. It's not any- Don't worry. Maybe later. No, don't fucking bother. I'm not going to say it now, I'm not playing this emotional game.